this afternoon. This is your buddy George Jones down there bragging about a guns and ammo. We got a few old guns we'd like to show you that are looking for a home, and and uh, they would be real nice additions to your home. Uh, we got our old revolver, six inch barrel, bent rib on it, target style revolver. Uh, this is the Llama Comanche. This gun is in, oh, I don't know, 95% condition. I haven't seen one of these things in several years. It used to be quite popular. Uh, it's a tack driving revolver. Uh, I had one just like it back in the day, and it was an outstanding 22 target revolver. Sunk a lot of beer cans in Fishing Creek with this thing. Um, outstanding gun. We've got a uh, two inch barrel model 10, 38 special with real pearl on it. Uh, I looked at it, took it off, looked at the back, uh, give it the old hound's tooth test and uh, it's real pearl. Uh, nickel finish, uh, beautiful job. Uh, they didn't nickel very many guns in this gun's age and time period. But whoever did the job on this one, if it's a uh, nickel job that someone had done, did a really good job. Uh, normally when you see guns like this that have been refinished, the letters and numbers are slightly rubbed out, you know, slightly disintegrated where they polished off the old blue. This one is not. I suspect that this is an original nickel job. Uh, this is a five screw military and police model, the forerunner of the Model 10. It is in excellent condition, uh, functions perfectly, locks up good. Uh, everything about it is just strack, just perfect. Uh, something you might want to think about if you want an heirloom quality gun to put in your safe or put in your collection, this is one of them. The little much sought after Model 34 Smith & Wesson kit gun and 22 long rifle, six shot. Uh, this is basically the same size as a Chief, except it has a four inch barrel and adjustable sights. This gun is a square butt. It's in 95% or better. Uh, the grips are in great shape for its age. Uh, just an outstanding little 22 caliber revolver. If you've got an outstanding young person in your home that you'd like to see them shooting a good quality gun, this would be a good quality gun to give them. Uh, if you like this sort of gun, we have two or three of this type of gun, and if you can come down here and look at them, decide for yourself. Outstanding little gun. Model 34 Smith & Wesson kit gun, 4 inch. We've got a Browning BDA. This is a 380. This is the uh, Browning manufactured this gun under license from Beretta. It's a Beretta Model 82, but it's manufactured by Browning Hersau Belgium. It's an outstanding gun. It's super clean inside and out. Uh, you hardly ever see this particular gun for sale anywhere. The uh, BDA they also manufacture the version of it of the SIG P226 or something. Manufactured under license by Browning. This is an outstanding gun. This would make an outstanding concealed carry gun, everyday carry gun, or collector gun. Just an outstanding gun. Comes with an extra magazine. It's also a Browning mag. And then last but not least, we got one of the coolest little guns ever made. And this one comes in presentation box. This is the high standard Derringer in nickel with black grips. This particular one is in 22 Magnum, the most desirable one. Uh, it's a tip up barrel, 22 Magnum, high standard Derringer, very desirable. It has a lot of firepower for two rounds and you can drop this guy in your pocket or you can drop it in your safe with the rest of the Queens. Either one's fine. It's just an outstanding gun, in excellent condition, in original presentation box. Well, that's about the size of it for this evening. Brag about a guns and ammo, 611 North College Street, Harrisburg, Kentucky. Uh, this Sunday we'll have CCDW class at noon here at the store. Uh, $75 a person. I generally pop for lunch. And uh, we generally have a good time doing it, and you can get your permit. 
All right, then. We'll see y'all have fun.